we on Boss Talk 101. Yeah, we gonna talk. I was with Pimp before, and I'm, I want to talk about something else that. I got a couple soon, of things that just keep popping up for as me. Soon, yeah. I, I got some things over yeah. here. I'm, I'm trickling like, can remember, okay. Yeah, I can remember before he really started doing a lot of outside producing, you know, and that type of thing. When he just produced for himself. Yeah, yeah. yeah. When he when he moved to Atlanta was when everything kind of really popped. Yeah. And he's, he, they, they, him and Bun call it rap hustling. Okay. That's what they called it. Um, I heard... I know I met the guy one time at the funeral, and so I'm not gonna bite my tongue. I heard a couple in it. I heard this guy say this a couple of times, so I know this is what he really feels. Mm -hmm. But uh, David Banner, okay, David Banner has this impression that Pimp C didn't know how to run the drum machine, and he taught Pimp how to run the drum machine. Really? Yeah, I've heard him say that a couple of times. He didn't know how to run a MP, okay, because the MP came out while he was locked up. Yeah. But man, he and I used to walk up in the studio with that ASR 10 and the R8 and kill most everything you heard from UGK pretty much in the in those the uh super tight yeah. and the uh um uh, uh, uh Ryan toward the swallow. Yeah, yeah, to yeah, Ryan Ryan Dirty. Dirty. Yeah. 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 Came out of Sand Jack, right? A lot okay. of it was recorded in Sand Jack on that ASR 10 mm -hmm. and that R8. And we used to walk up in the studio with that with those two pieces of equipment and everybody used to be like Where's everything else? <laughs> this all that's needed. That's all you need. This all this boy needed. You heard me say he cracked out that that beat in 15 minutes. Yeah, yeah. The boy was he was different. He was a little different, bro. Yeah. So why why do you think it probably because of the musical the, the, the musical? You know, I'm just talking about David Banner feeling that way because of the I don't age. Know. Well, you got the age difference. But what did he think if he made the beat song? They yeah. were they were not keyboard beats. Yeah, but they obviously the way that that. that Pimp could push maybe the speakers. He's, maybe he just wording it wrong, different. He's wording it way wrong. <laughs> that's that, that's out of line, bro. It's blasphemy. Yeah, for him to say that pimp didn't know how to run the drum machine. Come yeah, on, bro. Yeah, he yeah. Pocket yeah. full of stones. Woo. Are you serious? One man. Man, come that, on. That boy, that, that boy. I got a pocket full of stones. Like everything. Come on, man. And Bonnie tell you that R eight. Yeah. And then he gave that R eight to Steve Bilo. Below Steve Below sat on that R8 the whole time Pimp was in jail. So that's what Below was making his beat song. The everything Below was the main producer on my album. Okay. R8. That R8. Trained by the Pimp. When I first started so, back so in the Pimp definitely makes any on. kind of beats he wanted to oh, make. Oh my God. Come on, man. The boy. He's different. Wow. Well, you know, people, well, maybe because maybe Pimp told David Banner something about. He helped him to understand that type of beat machine. And that's what you think. <laughs> <laughs> let me tell you. Let me yeah, he's tell trying you. to hear it. Let yeah. me tell you, bro, because I, I sit back in the and, and why, I mean, have you ever addressed him on it? No, this is this first is me, time. This First is me time. addressing it. Okay. Yeah. Put that in your tag. Oh, okay. Okay. I'm going to okay. tag you. Okay. That's me right there. You're, I'm good you. on that. You're, yeah, let me tell you. <laughs> a lot of people. See, I hadn't been doing no interviews. This is my first. Really? Wow. Yeah, a lot of people. What made you do this one right? We got to ask that. We the dopest, <laughs> right? We, we, this well, is dope, going, man. I, I, this is the thing I'm because saying about Steve the Steve Below. No, let me tell you about back up to the Steve Below. Okay. And I spoke. And I said to him, I said, Below, you know what's been going on with you and I? See, I suffer from depression. Wow, he do too because but he's been he him didn't talking about that it. until Til you started talking, talking about, about it. it. I said, you ever think that that situation that we went through with him passing is what led us into our depression. I said, because at that time, you think about what was going on with me. This is what was going on with me. My record label was right here. Mm -hmm. I mean, two mixtapes were recorded. The album was, uh, second album was recorded. Um, everything, everything was working. Everything was moving. Chad was talking, you know, we were, we, everything was popping. Everything was popping. And then all of a sudden, my business partner go to jail. Mm-hmm. A um, couple years. I don't know how long he's going to be gone for. Uh, he's like the executive producer. You wow. know what I'm saying? I was the, I was the, the industry connect, yeah. the yeah. brain, yeah. And, and, and the artist. And he was the, that was my guy. Yeah. He was the street guy. He was the street guy. Yeah. He was you. Yeah. He was the bag. <laughs> Watch yourself. He was the bag. He done put me in there. He was the bag. You tell him the truth. He yeah. was the bag. You know what okay. I'm saying? Yeah, definitely. I started going through my divorce. That's a lot. Start going through my divorce. Um, Pimp died. That's a lot. And then my mom got diagnosed with um, diabetes and Alzheimer's at that time, with dementia at that yeah. time. Mm -hmm. So all that happened to me in oh. that year, in 2007. Wow. Yeah, all all in that second 
quarter and then that in that fourth quarter of the year. Everything pop, 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 hit me. And I'm not knowing. That's before people start talking about depression. Yeah, yeah, nobody's you know talking about mental illness. Well, well, they are, but they're not, not in the black community. Not in the right. black community. And I know that's so true. And not for men. Yes. Yeah. Man, shake that shit off, nigga. You know yeah, 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 yeah. You got to, yeah, you got to have, shake it off. You got to have a big boy. Yeah, yeah so it was a bunch of drinking stuff yeah. I didn't need Normally to be doing. Do. See, that's what I was yeah. going to ask you. Yeah. If you, yeah. you know who saved and my life? Who? Right there. Mm. Wow! Right there, and I could believe it because that was she around was the same time. I was. I already been calculating it over here. How did, how did she get through to you? Our friendship. We were friends first. Mm. You know, it's God. I I work on faith. Mm-hmm. Hey. Everything I've ever done, pretty much all my life, is like if you say if if I'm talking about an adventure, a, a venture, and then you say, "Hey, check this out, Bobo." I feel like God put me here to hear you say that. Mm-hmm. I think I'm here for a reason. Or a season. Yeah, we on Boss Talk 101. 101. Yeah, we gonna talk.